obviously uh, you and Mike are going to be probably looked at as two of the go-to guys, at least offensively. But Jimmy is saying he needs you guys to improve defensively. Is that something that you guys are sort of taking to heart and putting more pride in this year? As you go oh, yeah, that's something that I looked at, uh, forward. I looked at film a lot last year. Um, that's where we got beat at in most of our games. So I have to take more pride into playing defense, uh, me, myself, and my other teammates. Um, it's just been at the right places at the right time. Sometimes we might uh, be more focused and, or more, putting more energy to offense, but uh, we have to do more on defense because that's what it takes to win. So, yeah, he's been preaching about that a lot. So, Jamal, how much more help do you think you have as far as size and, and rebounding down low with this team? Oh, a lot. Uh, we got a lot of big men. I think uh, they're comfortable down low and they can finish uh, the basketball. So that will put me in more positions to create for others. So um, ACC is tough, a lot of big men. And we didn't have that last year. So we just had me and Mike Young uh, playing the four and the five. So we was undersized. So I think t this year will be great. Do you think the, uh, the big guys that you brought in, like uh, I guess three of them, do they all seem to do something a little different? Uh, Roselle. He's like more of a take up the paint guy. Uh, he's play, he plays hard. Uh, Alonzo, he's like a call him Tim Duncan. He can make the mid range. He can uh, he have a little skill to him. And Rose out. I mean, um, Raphael, I didn't see him out there lately because his finger. So um, what I did send him out there, he was pretty decent. So uh, we got a lot of mix to them guys. We can put them to the four or the five. So it's great. What are the sort of things that you've worked on over this offseason to better um, position yourself to play at three? Say it again? Like, what, are the, what are the things you've worked on this offseason to better play the uh, three position? Uh, just make the three-pointer uh, and be more quick on defense. That's about – I've been playing the three, the two. I played the one in high school, so I'm, I'm not – I'm too comfortable with it. So I'm not that off comfortable, you know. So this year I've just been practicing and being more quicker on defense and making a three-pointer. So everything else is natural, I guess. Oh, it's like that so many different faces and bringing guys with a lot of experience that are coming in for a year. How have you guys matched so far for practice starts? Uh, it will be tough. Um, these past couple of weeks, we've been preaching on, Dixon been preaching the same thing over and over. But I think as the week's been coming, the guys have been listening and we've been getting more better at what he want, what he want to do, because he's been preaching on defense. Uh, we might be looking at a new little offense, so it just takes time. We got a month, a uh, couple of weeks, so I can't wait. Jamil, can you kind of talk about your role as a leader on this team? I mean, you've got an interesting kind of mix, a bunch of transfers, some older senior guys, and then you know Damon and some of the younger freshmen. Do you look at yourself as a leader on this team and kind of what do you think the leadership dynamic is like on this team right now? Uh, per se, this is me, Mike, and James right now for the leadership. Uh, we the guys, the returning guys came, put in a lot of work. So uh, for us three, we have to come out and lead these guys because they're young and they don't know the offense or the defense yet and what coach want. Uh, we have to lead them to be better. And for us, we have to uh, set the tone. So it, it starts with us. Uh, we also need our teammates, our big men, to play hard. Because if they don't play hard, then it'll be a long year like last year. So we just have to all come together and be great.